hey guys welcome back so we have seen how do we create user in am how do we create groups in am in this video we'll explore how do we give permission to a group or a user so as per best practice we should always give permission to a group and then the permission flows back to user if we assign do assignment of a group to to a user or vice versa so i have just logged into the application again go to tools security and the permission and here we see the already existing uh, groups or users available on the, on the screen we have the filter available we want to see view all we want to see groups as well as users we want to see just users and if you want to see only groups another uh, thing is if for example if i have just selected users we can search here so i have created this test user so we can search it and then if we just select this user it on the right side we can see this user is having permission for what so these are the privileges um, gcr all there are other privileges also there is a nice documentation of check rabbit here uh, i'll just put this link also in the description of the video we can you guys can understand what is the meaning of uh, which property is having what meaning so for example wrap new privileges gcr read gcr all modify delete so all those uh, properties we have and then we can define the privileges here now if i go back to groups again the same thing i can just search the group so for example my group test is coming and i can i can select and i can see the existing permissions if there are any now <clears throat> if we want to add a new uh, privilege or permission if you want to revoke something we need to click on add ACE here we need to give the path um, let's just understand for example if for example for administrator we don't have anything I'll just add it any of the existing one see the path is slash it means I mean it's applicable for all content and uh, let's let me add it to my test group only We just added it it says on this path and uh, but privilege is given is read per permission but if you want to give maybe uh, some other permission so if you just start typing in it will give for example for jcr these are all our permissions are available we give all it means i want to give a brief permission to this jcr all or jcr right if i want to give write permission to the repository and then permission type so, so for example i want to allow this permission or i want to deny this permission so we have two types here and restrictions also so in the these restrictions are available so again we have the nice documentation so these are the restrictions and their meanings so for example replic rep group it, it means a single name path or path pattern and we can give the regular expression also here and then the restriction value let me just show you one of the existing one so that so for example this one so under conf if i'll edit it <coughs> it says for rep subtrees this is the restriction and we can give permission of type of allow or deny quite straightforward yeah so likewise we create can create multiple groups <coughs> few groups are already um, available as part of the setup initial setup but we can create our own group and then we can associate those groups uh, with users and we can provide some privileges to that group those privileges will automatically go to uh, users so that's it in this video. Thank you so much for watching.